All right, Finn has just enjoyed some breakfast, and he's lounging around. We are at um, Reedsville Lake Campground, and our site is 27. Is that right? Yes. We're at 27. Site 27, we are right next to the uh, shower house, and this is what it looks like right out of the dinette. And uh, guys, what we're going to do is we're just going to give you a brief little summation here about uh, the campground, and then I'm going to show you um, our site outside. And uh, for those that have been following us, um, we're going to go through the fun facts. We are in Rockingham County, Rockingham County, North Carolina. This is a new county, so we're going to go over to some fun facts and things about um, the area that we're in. Some of them you may know, some of them you may not know. But um, <clears throat> we are at 27, which is, where is 27 at? Can you point it out there? I don't know, I'm looking. It's right here. Here it is. The circles are very confusing. 27. Yeah. Now. This is, you know, they give you a basic little map here. These are all the sites. Now, they are on the sea. All the ones that are circled, you see these circles here? Well, that means that they're all reservable. So it looks like the whole map's reservable. They've got some that are just squares. See these squares here? Well, that means that those are first come, first serve. First come, first serve. And there's not many of those on there. Just a couple. Yeah. Um, now, all the sites have electrical hookups. Um, and only, there's only a few of, uh, I'd say less than 20. Yeah. It looks like it's maybe less than 20 that have sewage hookups. And that's the ones with all the stars, mm -hmm. all the stars. And so those and would they be, also have monthly. they got monthly rental sites. Now that's all of your triangles mm -hmm. are, are monthly sites. So those of you that like to stay a whole month at a time, they do have that out here. But you can only stay a month and then you have to leave for a month. Yeah. And you, then you can come you back stay for a month and then you leave for a month and then you stay for a month and then you leave for a month. And mm -hmm. so, um, and I think it's pretty reasonably priced. I think it's, I want to say it's, uh, maybe a little under 400 bucks or mm -hmm. close to it. You guys can check it out. Our and, site was $32 a night and the ones that don't have full hookups, I'm going to say maybe it's th 28 or $30 a night. Ours is $32? Yes. Yeah, so $32. $32 a night. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, but um, other than that, guys, this is the uh, basic overview. And so it does say that all of the sites have electricity. We are not 100% sure if all the sites have water. They probably do. They probably do. I do know that all the sites near the water, all those sites, they do not have sewage. Mm -hmm. And it's probably some code or something like that. Well, this this lake is used for um, drinking water purposes. Yes. So if you look at the bottom, there's no swimming for humans or pets in the lake. Yeah. Um, since they do, and that's something, this is something, This I guess is probably the first one that I've ever known that um, every, a campground that we've been near a lake where the lake was used as a water source for the city and so they do not allow animals or pets to swim in the lake. Or humans. Though, or humans. Though, they will allow you to ski. Well, you're going to be in the water when you're skiing, so I'm not really yeah, sure. Not sure to, it, that. That's a little confusing with me. But I guess you're not swimming, yeah. constantly swimming in it. And so... Also, the, lo the longest, if you go to the chart right here, the longest rig, it looks like it's 40 feet long. Yeah, we looked at all these. Every one of these, and it looks like if you're any longer than 40 feet, you may not be able to get in here. So I would double check with the campground, see if they've updated anything. Um, and so, but guys, let's go outside and let me show you the site real quick. Okay, this is our site here. This is going to be site 27. Site 27. Um, the levelness, um, you're going to need to have some means of leveling your camper. Um, ours is a little, the site 27 is a little low on this side. Um, but like I said, it's nothing, um, significant, I would say. And so, um, the grounds are all gravel from what we're seeing. Um, we haven't checked out every single, um, camping site. 
uh, but it appears to be, from what we saw, mostly gravel is what you're going to get yourself into. Um, it is, the site that we're at is water, sewer, and electrical hookup. They, looks like the panel box here is well taken care of. As you can see, I've got all of the breakers on. And they told me that the only way I'm going to get power is that if I turn all of the breakers on. Usually I would shut off everything but just what I need, which is 30 amp. But they told me that their breakers are designed to where you have to have them all on to get electric, electric power. And so that's the first time I've ever seen anything like that. Um, we're right next to the shower house here. So for those of you that want to be near the shower house or right beside of it, um, just look on the map. And uh, again, this is the other end of it. As far as overhanging branches, um, there's not much here. Um, just a very little. And uh, but it is a really nice site. Um, they got a pad for the um, picnic table. There is a fire ring, and um, and this is our view. We can see the lake from here, and um, it's very well taken care of. Um, they uh, I'm trying to think anything else. Um, they. Uh, Anything over 40 feet, 40 feet, you might want to double check with the campground and see if they can accommodate you. Uh, the site that we are in is a pull-through site. So we came in this way, and we just, just drive all right on out and go on. They do have, uh, their areas that you drive in are very well marked one way, and so I do like that and appreciate that. Uh, but other than that, guys, um, this is our site, 27 27 and this is at uh, Lake Reedsville campground in um, Rockingham County North Carolina